Hi everyone, so I'm in the middle of moving house, but I thought I'd do a very, very quick um, March favourites for you. So we'll just jump right in. It is super small, but yeah, hopefully you'll like the products too. So the first thing while I'm wearing it, and it is right here on me, is this top. Um, I will put a link to it down below and a little picture of it here. But yeah, it's such a lovely top and I actually got it as a um, gift. So yeah, I have been loving it. Um, I got it last week, I think. But yeah, really, really love it. And I actually got a bigger size than I would have usually gone for, but it works really well. So if you are looking to buy this, go for the next size up um, is my advice. And then it looks really like casual and especially with the sunny weather, it's so lovely. Next thing is the Caroline Hirons and Pixie Double Cleanse. I've been adoring this. It has literally got me through. Um, I never really double cleansed uh, or knew the importance of it until I'd got this product and then I suddenly realised how clean my skin felt when I used this. So now whatever cleanser I'm using, I will double cleanse with it. But I do like this with a balm and then a sort of cream. So you have that variation for your skin, which is amazing. Sticking to skincare, the Pixi Glow Tonic, which I've heard people rave about over and over again. Um, and yeah, I have been loving this. Um, it's just one of those things that I, I needed a new sort of toner. So I thought I'd splash out a little bit and get this because I usually get very cheap toners, not like special ones. And I have been absolutely loving it and I probably couldn't do without. And I've actually used it loads and it's literally not even gone down that much. So I love that as well. <laughs> so it's well worth it. If you haven't tried it, it's definitely a really good introduction to um, glycolic acid because it's, it's only 5%. So it's not too bad and it sort of steps your skin into that world and feeling all those things and all that sort of stuff. It's slightly tingly, but it's like a good tingly. It's almost like a clean tingly. So yeah, and that dies down very, very quickly. It's only for a matter of seconds really. And then you're back to normal. I have been wearing so much makeup lately. Um, not as in a lot on my face, but I've been wearing it more often than I usually would. So I've got two foundations that I've been absolutely loving this month. The first is the Revlon Color Stay. It gives me sort of a really dewy look, which I literally adore, especially when my skin is looking slightly dry or dull. I love this, but it's now slightly too light for me. So I've moved on to an old favorite, which is the Bourjois Healthy Mix, which I love. I only started using this again really recently and I've got it on today and my skin just glows and it's such a great color. It's slightly darker. If I put them up against each other, it's slightly darker. So it's more of a summer foundation for me, but it's such a lovely glowy, light sort of foundation but with really good coverage so you couldn't really ask for anything more than that and i'm gonna stop rambling about it sticking to makeup i have recently tried out the dr hauschka mascara this is really really new um i'm not even sure if it's launched yet so this might not be an appropriate product but um yeah i think it has and i'll put everything below anyway so you can find out but yeah it's a natural makeup brand which some makeup brands say they're natural and they're not 100% where this one is so that's really helpful and I'm actually wearing it today with nothing else and I usually have to put like two different mascaras on but it just gives you these lovely like wispy lashes which, which is ideal um, and really great for a day mascara. I wouldn't use this for night really because it doesn't hold as well and um, it's really easy to like take off and all that sort of stuff so that's a great like everyday sort of mascara I think and that's probably going to be my go-to mascara from now on but yeah I've only literally had this for like two weeks and I tried it maybe maybe a week ago maybe a bit less and I I just love it it's crazy and the final thing is the vice palette I actually was given this by someone and because they didn't really use it or whatever and I literally love it. So all the colours are on the back here and there's such a range of colours. It's so helpful when I want to maybe just switch up my look, like keep everything exactly the same but just switch it up with a lipstick 
and it's so so helpful it's the best thing ever so yeah my favorite colors are safe word which is like this sort of nudie brownie color and i really like 714 as well for a nice like classic bright red it's great so it comes in this lovely mirrored uh holder or whatever it is with a mirror here and then you have sort of a flap that says lipstick is my vice and then all the lip colors and a lip brush so you can see they're so bright i don't think i'd go for this one i think it's a bit too pale for me but everything else in there i love and i use i had um like a sample that i ended up using instead so this is brand new and i'm loving the colors and that is it from me i hope you liked this video i told you it would be super quick um yeah so probably the next video i do will be in my new house so it'll be a whole new setting and yeah hopefully you like it so i will see you in the next one don't forget to subscribe and see you bye